I am Rick Metian with episode number 103 of our MLB Show 20 or the show featuring Chance Bishop taking on the Houston Astros to start this episode off. And well, there you guys, Chance Bishop did play half a season with the Astros. I mean, he made it very clear though that he was not going to return to the Astros, and the Astros tried to. You know, they tried to give him the bag, tried to give him a big boy paycheck, but Chance was like, no, not doing it. Uh, but there you go, that, you know, first base, you know, error, little gaff right there defensively. Bishop would not have done that. You know why? Because Bishop is a gold glove first baseman. Some could call him a platinum glove first baseman. But the speed, the power, the defensive ability of Chance Bishop is better than any first baseman in the league hands down. As soon as I say that, though, we do ground out right there. But unfortunate, to say the least. Now, top ninth, we're down five. Um, Orioles taking the day off this game. I think we played a lot of our backups. It had to have been one of our backups pitching, you know. Probably called up a guy from single A, you know. Just some, like, 15-year-old kid drafted out of high school. Had to have been what happened. Uh, but bottom ninth, uh, Mark Woodruff only had 74 pitches thrown. So, no one looking at Mark's pitches at all. Chance Bishop beats out an infield single right there. Now, let's try not not have, uh, I think, the starter have 74 pitches by the ninth inning. As Bishop gets on base right there with a one-out single. Runner moves up to third base right there. So, we're on the corner now. All right, top of the third inning. Our pitcher already at 40 pitches. So, you got to think, hey, uh, Astros starter only had 30 more pitches to the ninth inning from now. Uh, but Bishop tries to go second on that one. Runner safe and could not make the return throw either. And follow that one off first baseman. Another defensive gaffe by that first baseman. Showing you why Bishop is in fact better than the Astros current first baseman. And now bottom of the fifth chance. Rounds down to the first baseman. He's going to go to second base in time. Not in time on the return though. And Kansas City does lead though. But... Is what it is here. As a rare, just another defensive blunder. Uh, but no first base blunder this time as Bishop sends that one deep into the outfield. A grand slam right there. Blows this game wide open. You'll love to see that one right there. 49th home run on the season for Chance Bishop. 440 feet total. 106 off of the bat. That is, in fact, a big boy daddy hack, as the kids these days say. Uh, but, moving on from there, look at that. High fives all around. Gets the replay of that one. Bishop violently throws that bat down. Boom, thro drops the bat. That one's going way gone. Third baseman puts his hands on the knees because he is just about disrespected right there. Now, bottom of the eighth inning, Bishop. Not quite home run distance, maybe in an elevator as the third baseman has to reach out for that one. Looks like he uh, got a late break on it for whatever reason. Uh, but Astros are down two to nine. Now at top of the ninth inning, uh, no one out so far. Let's uh, let's get it out right here. Connor Woodall, all right. Connor introduces the ground ball to Chance. Chance Bishop doesn't botch that one. Uh, tosses to the pitcher for whatever reason, just to you know, keep it interesting. And Robinson does ground out. Look at that beer by Woodall. Great beer. Now, bottom of the first inning. Here we go. Game of three of the series. We split it all. Now, one each as Bishop grounds out into the play, actually. So, we're on third now. That's unfortunate. Royals do take the lead, though. It is a one nothing ball game. And here we go. Bishop charges it. Backhands it. Steps on first base for the out. And that's what you want to do right there if you're a chance. You just got to get the out right there. Now, Bishop just sitting around looking like a statue almost. He's doing great. Bomb four, come on, Bishop. We need you to do some big, big lumberjack swings. But, you know, Chance Bishop can only do so much as he gets himself a single right there. Not quite as big of a swing as you wanted. Uh, but, bomb the sixth inning, we can increase the lead. Or we can ground out to the shortstop. Either one's fine. It's okay, Chance. You don't always have to hit home runs. It's just honestly better when you do. Uh, but Felix Chavez, you love to see that. Wait, look at him just, you know, making the throws. Now, bottom of the ninth inning, here we go. We're down by two. And Bishop just takes one off the hip right there. He's not tough it out there because he is, in fact, a trooper. 
I'll be on the next series or something against the Cardinals. Rematch against the Cardinals for the first time since we lost them in the World Series. As well, Bishop gets walked here in the first, puts two men on with only one out. All right. Now, at top of the third, two men on, no one out. As Bishop strikes out on that changeup right there. Hey, you see that? It's going to be the pitcher's first strikeout. Now, at top of the fifth, down by two. As Shan sends that one to the outfield. Deep left field. And not far enough back, as that's going to be a fly out. You really do hate to see that one right there. Wooded track power. Now down 4 1 is Chance. You know, drives this inside slider deep to left field. That one had the distance. And no, just warning track power here at Bush Stadium. Now, next game against the Cardinals and Chance. Not even warning track power here. It takes a change of kind of just pops it up to the shallow outfield. And the second baseman makes the play right there. First out, I guess second out of the first inning. For a chance right there. Just not great hitting against the Cardinals for whatever reason. Now down by one. In the fourth inning, Chance Bishop again pops it up. This time infield grass. Third base but makes the play on it. And he tried to go to second, but Chance just not. Can't get Brett Batty. Former teammate Brett Batty right there. Love to see it, I guess. You know, Brett Batty wins a ring. You know, ties Chance Bishop. As there you go, gets his first hit of this series. Nash Chance, you know, and the Royals are down 3-1 to one now with two outs here in the sixth inning. Definitely need to rally something, but no offense that inning as well. Two Cardinals are on. No one's out. It's going to be a bunt attempt. Bishop charges that one. He's going to go to third, get the force out there. Keeps the runners more or less where they're at, so you got to love to see that right there. Bishop head up play by the veteran first baseman right here. Now that will be good as a fielder's choice. So hopefully a double play gets them out of the inning. And no, we are down 7-1 to one now. Top of the eighth as Bishop swings through that one. For the strikeout to end the inning right there. You really do hate to see that. Bishop just, I don't know what's up with playing against the Cardinals. Bishop just can't play against them for whatever reason. And now a pop-up bottom of the eighth. Bishop ranging way, way back. Calling off the second baseman. There you go, makes the catch. You love to see that one right there to end the inning. But Cardinals do hold off to win this game, which frankly is uh, the last thing you want to do when you're trying to win games, is lose back-to-back -back games to the team that beat you in the World Series. Uh, but if you guys enjoyed this episode, hit that like button. Comment down below if your favorite part of the episode was. You know, comment down below. What do, you, what do you think is the reason why Chance can't, can't hit against the Cardinals? Do you think that's that Cardinals dark magic over here that prevents Chance from hitting against them? Uh, but, I'll take some YouTube though. Peace out. Rock on. Stay super classy. Make sure you guys are, in fact, washing your hands because the best way to prevent being sick is just by washing your hands and covering your nose when you sneeze. So, peace out. Have a great day.